Welcome to the BBS Online video tutorial for adding a transect route for one of your sites. So you've logged in to the BBS Online system and you can see that there's a route missing for one of your sites. You can either add the route by clicking on the orange button there or going through to view route and from here selecting the site you wish to add a route for. Please ensure you read the transect map in help before you press OK to continue. Once the transect mapping page is opened, you're able to change the background map to satellite map or OS map. And you can add details such as the site name, which is deleted if the site is allocated to anybody else, um, or site notes, which is saved for future surveyors. To add a transect, press Add New Transect section. And here we have a BBS square, so we'll be drawing two parallel lines uh, containing 10 200 meter sectors. For the Waterways Breeding Bird Survey, you would draw a route along a waterway using the primary map, which you can get from BTO HQ, and you'll be drawing between one and 10 500 meter sectors along that waterway. But for now, we'll draw a route for BBS and it's the same setup for WBBS routes. To start drawing the transect, click on the map and then click again everywhere you wish to make a turn. We'll be trying to keep these transect lines as straight as possible. And I'm checking over here for the length of the transect. I want this to be one kilometre for this transect section. So once I've reached the one kilometre mark, I double click to finish that transect. We'll then need to add the second transect route. Again, click once, drag, click at every turn. until you reach that one kilometre mark and you'll double click and create that second transect. Now it's worth at this point just adding the distance bands to the transect just to make sure there's absolutely no overlap and you've avoided any right angles along the transect line as well as this can cause double counting on the inside corner of any right angles. From here you can either cancel the edit or you can save the changes. And your map has been drawn online. So now you've drawn your route, you might want to have a little look at it and maybe print it off. So from the view route page, you can select view and print. This will open up your map again. You can show both maps and have one as OS and one as satellite. You can add the route, the distance bands, and you can change your preferences. So change the colors of the features on the map. So that they show up nicely for you. And you can also fade the background map as well. If it makes it easier to see the transit. Once you've done that, you'll be ready to print your map. You can also choose to show grid references, which can be very useful in remote areas with a few landmarks. Once you've set up the pages you wish to print, then you simply print the map. Follow the instructions as you would print in anything else from your computer. We're back at the BBS Online homepage and you've realised you need to either add notes to your transect route or change the route itself. Before changing the route itself, we ask that you speak to your regional organiser or national organiser to make sure that that's all OK. By changing a route, you're changing the survey itself and data are compared year on year by sector level, not square level. So by changing your route, you're changing the area in which you're collecting data which are compared then to the previous years. So after speaking to your regional organiser or national organiser and it's agreed that you have to change the route, you can do so by logging in and going to view route. From here 
we select edit map again read the transect mapping help and then click OK now we're at the BBS transect mapping page you can add your site name which is deleted when a site is allocated to anybody else so only you see this or site notes which remain in the system for future volunteers uh, this will be useful information that uh, future volunteers might need to know and you might want to add notes for the sectors themselves to do this you click on the flag and press edit notes if it's the route itself you need to update select the flag for the sector you wish to update you can zoom in at this stage select a flag press edit route you can then select this sector and move it around and put bends in it and so on again I'm looking at this sector length it needs to be 200 meters for the BBS 500 meters for WBBS so once you've got the sector edited and the lengths you require double click and that's edited for you then you have to press update route and that's changed and you can do this for any of the sectors by clicking on the flag and going over to edit route or edit notes remember here to save the changes your route has now been updated and that's been saved so you can finish an exit this takes you back to your view route page